Introducing Creative Upscale and Pulse Project Dream. This feature enables you to enlarge any image up to eight times its original size while creatively enhancing details, textures, and overall realism. To try it out, head to the Creative Upscaler section, browse or drop in your work. Select your upscale ratio, then click Dream. With these default settings, we've made minimal adjustments to the input image. This ensures that the four times upscaling process enhances the necessary details, producing a sharper and slightly more realistic output. In another example, let's apply a stronger influence to an aerial image in its draft stage. Let's try it with a slightly higher creativity, contrast that with a higher image strength, and finally apply some restoration to fill in some details for us. Also, let's crank those settings up another notch and submit another one to see which one we like better. The lower settings produced a stable upscale with subtle changes and additional details. In contrast, the higher settings provided the image with a much more pronounced enhancement. You can rate your images based on your satisfaction with the results. This feedback helps us improve and also allows you to revisit and reference the settings that produce the best outcomes for you. In this next example, we will be upscaling an image that contains some 3D characters. Such characters can occasionally appear slightly deformed or smudged. We can correct this by processing the result through the Character Enhancer feature. This looks much better, but they look a little bit too serious. Let's put a smile on their faces. There we go, looking good. For our final example, let's push the Creative Upscaler to its limits by inputting a very low resolution render that also includes some characters. As you can see, with maximum creativity and very high restoration strength, you can upscale images that are only a few hundred pixels in dimensions and still achieve decent results. For more information, community, tips, and tricks, be sure to join our Discord channel. Link in the description below.